It's opening night for the Mountaineers as they take on Missouri State. And this will be the first game since 2007 that this team will not be coached by the legendary Bob Huggins. I spent the whole day going around campus and the local sports bars asking fans what they'll miss most about the legendary coach and what their expectations are for this new season. I, I'm just going to miss him, man. I mean, sitting on a bar stool. With, I mean, no other coach does that. I mean, he was just a unique coach. He embodied West Virginia. Some of the things he would say, you know, his charisma, how he would interact with the fans, some of the things he would say to the ref and how he would act, that'd probably be the best. In July, WVU announced that Hall of Fame coach Bob Huggins was relieved of his duties as head coach, stating that he had resigned, although Huggins has imminently denied that claim and wanted his job back, but was not reinstated by the university. This news of Huggins leaving deeply affected the entire fan base. It was disappointing. I mean, since I've, as a kid watching WV basketball, he's always been coached. It was, it was really heartbreaking. I, I'd, I'd love to have him back now. But now, WVU basketball starts a new chapter with Josh Eilert taking the head coaching reins. And fans say they understand this year will be challenging, but they hope for the best. Like every coach starts out slow, and I think that's what he's going to do. But then he'll pick back up like in the middle of the season and get us together. A new, a new head coach in anything means zero expectations. So we can go in pretty much on a solid foundation saying, hey, we hope for the best, but if it doesn't go the way we planned, then that's okay. Other fans have a bit higher of expectations. Even though the Mountaineers finished last in the Big 12 Conference last season, and along with the new head coach in town, some fans see a brighter future ahead. Over 17 wins and at least make the NCAA tournament. I don't really know the head coach that well, but I, I really have faith in the assistant coaches, so I'm hoping. Keeping you connected, I'm Cam Murray, 5 News.